Indiana is Allie Bear. Allie Bear, he's got a preview of what's to come for Acadian Culture Day, so let's just send it to him. Hey guys, we are back. We're in Vermilionville. We're talking about Acadian Culture Day coming up. I have Miranda Belk here, who's the curator. And we're talking about something that's kind of a big deal. It's gotten in the last few years. It's Acadian Brown Cotton. So tell yes. us about this. Um, so Acadian brown cotton is indigenous to the Louisiana area. Um, originally, the Acadians in Nova Scotia, they spun things to make clothes and textiles out of um, wool or flax seed. But coming down here, Louisiana, obviously, it's way too hot. Um, so they stumbled upon the indigenous, excuse me, indigenous cotton here and took that over instead. Uh, in some of these cases, we have the process from uh, two different types of seeds that have been ginned. So they have been extracted from the raw cotton that has been picked. Uh, the hand gin is a lot cleaner than what goes through a machine and comes out still kind of fuzzy. We have some of the raw cotton over here as well as what it looks like in the ground on a bowl and uh, hand cards in the back. So this is what would have been used um, hundreds of years ago to kind of stretch the fibers and make them all go in one direction to then make your sliver. And we have a white cotton versus a brown cotton sliver here. And it takes six of these to make one corded fiber. And corded fiber is what would today go through a machine or in a uh, hundred years ago would go through a spinning wheel to make your thread. And you have some finished products over here. Yes, we do. So let's take a look. So over here, we have a couple of different types of yarn that have been made, uh, some with the machine, some handmade. Um, we have these weaving shuttles in the back, which would have been used to make these different types of fabrics up here on the second level. Um, these two are machine made. These are heritage patterns. These uh, were replicated from a private collection of um, anywhere between 100 to 250 year old Acadian brown cotton blankets. We also have a um, sock here made, and then these on the end are handmade. These were hand woven. Wow, pretty neat. And uh, what is that right there at the top? That... Uh, up at the top up here, we have a chapel veil made entirely of brown cotton yarn. Wow, that's pretty cool. Okay, you know what, Miranda, thank you. We are gonna go back to Storm Track 15 meteorologist, Adam Olivier.